How's it going, everyone? I'm Nostalgic Dave, and welcome back for the Nostalgia Train. Alright, one thing I did not check for that's kind of important. I don't know how loud this is for you guys, but we'll go with it. I can barely hear Jack Diddley, so hopefully it works out. Um... I think we can, hello, we can actually come this way. Come up here. Stop. What? Do something. What's wrong? What? There's something here. Huh? Um. Hey, is there really something down this hall? There definitely is. Be very, very careful. Games warning me to be cautious. Oh boy. Here? Where am I? It's an empty room. Well, empty ish. Okay. What the? <laughs> Do something. something wrong? This room seems to be set up for black magic or witchcraft or. How do you figure? I don't see anything out of the ordinary. Come on, we should keep moving. You said there was a presence out by the incinerator, right? Alright, let's go. Actually, how about you go on ahead, and I'll catch up with you. Uh... That's not what I selected. Huh? What's that voice just now? I didn't say any of that. Shinozaki! Hey! Shinozaki! What? What is it? What's going on? No! Uh oh. Shinuma! Ishinuma! Am I trapped in here? Open up! Come on! Uh oh. Somebody open the damn door! Come on! Please? Shinozaki? Hi! Haven't seen you in a while. Am I ever glad to see you? And alive, no less. Are you all right? I'm shocked. Now I'm hearing Miss Yui's voice. This turns out to be a fake, too. I'm really gonna lose it. What are you talking about? Come on, over here. There's nothing to be afraid of anymore. Please. I don't trust this. I know she's still alive, but I don't trust this. It really is you. Where have you been all this time? You've been worried sick. I'm so sorry. It must have been terrifying in here all by yourself. Oh, God. Miss Yui, you're injured. Pretty severely, too, from the looks of it. Yeah. She was a... Um, my arm is in bad shape. Shinozaki, come on, stand up. We're getting out of here. Oh boy, I don't trust this. I don't trust this. What the hell? A trap door? Okay, if anything, I did not expect that. Quickly! Grab hold of my leg. 
Why won't my body? Okay, yeah, that's the real Miss Yui. Never mind. Okay. I can't support support both our weights with one arm for much longer. My fingers are. Hurry, Shinozaki! You'll fall in too. I, I know. She's gonna let. She's gonna let this happen. Both of them are gonna fall. Yep. Miss Yui! Miss Yui! Come on, you're almost there. Whoa. Welcome back. Miss Yui! Grab her hand! No, don't! I'll climb up on my own. This floor could collapse at any moment. You two need to get out of here. But, do it! And Kishinuma, take care of Shinazaki. Miss Yui! Shinazaki, come on. Shinozaki! <clears throat> Shinozaki, be strong. No matter what happens, be s Oh no. Is she about to sacrifice her own life for them? You have abilities that can outmatch anyone else's. Once you get out of here, I know everything's going to work out just fine. You know, with that dream of yours we were talking about. Now get the hell out of here. Wow. Don't you understand the gravity of this situation? Go! Now! Oh boy. Yeah, that. You know, like every single time we hear the word. Miss Yui. Miss Yui. Shinazaki. Come on. We have to move. Let go of me. I don't care anymore. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Yeah, that. Listen, you may be willing to let Miss Yui's sacrifice go to waste, but I'm not. Kishinuma. This is what she meant when she said parting words. Be trophy earned, parting words. This is what she meant when she said be strong, damn it. Oh, great. This guy. Who? It's the principal. Uh. I don't trust this. Strange looking incinerator. Almost seems like something you'd see in a cremator. Crematorium. What's that? Looks like somebody threw something in there. It's. Very yellow. You can see a yellow ribbon a few feet in, covered in soot. I, I think it's the ribbon from from Sashiko's dress, but it's, it's out of reach. Arms not quite long enough. Also, I noticed yesterday that the echo was kept on on my mic, so I kind of adapted into it. In the darkness within the incinerator, the figure of a girl can faintly be seen. She's squatting with hands around her knees. What? Whoa! It's... It's Sachiko. Uh, upon meeting your gaze... She spins in place and begins crawling deeper into the machine, till she vanishes from sight. Huh? What the hell? Pretty cramped in there. But it looks like maybe with a little effort, you could 
fall down pretty far through this thing. Actually, look over there. What a tiny pinprick of light. It, it might be a room or something. Good a lead as any. Wait, are you nuts? This is an incinerator. What if somebody lights it up while we're inside? Good point. Okay, you wait here, and I'll go by myself. Uh, you? Okay, fine. I'll go too. Okay, then. I told you to wait at the talk. No way! I'm coming with you! Damn it! Be care well, be careful in here, okay? There are some pretty thick clumps of dust and ash that you'll get yourself caught on if you don't watch out. Thanks. <laughs> what is going on? Damn, it's a tight squeeze in here. We've come pretty far, but it seems like we're still only about halfway. Maybe it's because the ceiling's so low that I can't even come close to standing up. But I've honestly never felt this uneasy before in my life. I can only imagine why. If the exits all get blocked, I can wind up stuck in this position forever. What the hell is wrong with me? I shouldn't think about things like that. Man, my elbows are sore as hell. I've never seen so much dust and ash before. I can't keep breathing this in. Yeah. Okay, where are we on time? I'm trying to keep track, but keep an eye on everything simultaneously. Ow! Hey, you all right? Just pricked my hand a little. There's some kind of metal wire in here. Good to know. Turn back. Why would I want to listen to you, Sachiko? Please, turn back. Again, why would I want to listen to you? You're the antagonist. No, keep going. I'm not going to listen to you. Well, that clinches it. There's definitely something in here. Come on. Uh, okay. Turn back. No. Stay away. What was that? Didn't I tell you to turn back? <laughs> oh no. I, I I I I did a bad. <sighs> huh? Where? What? An underground tunnel system. Who would have thought there'd be something like this beneath the school? Big Brother, I have to pee again. Oh my gosh. Hold it in. Okay, I didn't expect that kind of response, but okay. Ah, crap. Um... What the hell? Ugh. Yeah, pretty much that, yeah. All these heads just wind up like prizes. God. <laughs> these don't look particularly old either. I, I think they're victims of the curse who got trapped here. Just like us. What kind of sick person would take the time to line them up so neatly? Sachiko. Or the principal. <coughs> Maybe someone obsessed... 
someone obsessive compulsive? No. I don't think so. Someone who takes pride in his collection. Not someone I'd want to meet, that's for sure. Yeah, I would imagine. Okay. Oh, jeez. Hi. Right? Right? I get what it's having me do. Okay, right, right, left, right. Right. Right, right, left, right, right. Okay. Right. Right. Left. Right. Right. Dear Shiho, stay strong. No matter what happens, no matter what you may see, never lose that immovable will of yours. Fight the darkening. Don't let it take you over. If you can beat it, then you can beat fate itself. Pretty ominous message. Doesn't bode well for us. Eh, I wouldn't say that. Ow! Wait, people? Come again? I, uh, um... You... Here, you drop this. Uh... What? Uh, oh, 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 okay, bye, Taguchi. What the hell? What just happened? I have... No idea. He just looked at my face and then he... Come on. We should make our way through here as quickly as we can. Weird things seem to be the norm down these tunnels. What? Yeah, that might be kind of important, actually. Imagine this would be the way to go. Ah, great. It's basically a maze. <sighs> Alright. This way, and... Can't go that way. Let me guess. There's another switch that... Yeah. Unless Tagachi could really jump far, he didn't really have anywhere to go. So where did he go? Okay, over here. Of course it's going to make me go back. This is a really strange puzzle. Of course, then there's a candle. That could only say so much good. <sighs> Let's go. I don't like it. Okay. Um, we got a little bit of time left. Okay. Oh, so it's... Oh, my gosh. We're getting close to the end. We might extend this. According to what I'm looking at, it's close to the end. Actually. Yeah. We're basically nearing the end. Extensive episode. Okay. What's over here? Uh, staircase. Um, no? What the? 
I was worried for a moment there. All right. What? what uh. Okay. Very right. Middle. Very right. Oh, God. Oh, God. Down? Was it all the way? Nope, dead. That did not look like it. That looked like it hurt. Ow. That explains what this area is for. Okay, let's try that again. Okay. Five, three, five, three, oh, two, two, one, all the way up. Okay. Five, three, five, three, two, two, one, all the way up. There we go. Actually, that, that made it a bit easier. Hello. Why is it dark? What is this place? It smells absolutely overpowering. You okay, Yuka? Um, I don't like this place. What the hell? What the hell is this room? What is it used for? The table sure does have a lot of blood stains on it. Um, why are we all separated suddenly? look at everything till a cutscene apparently you run your fingers along the lip of the bucket out of morbid curiosity and the dried blood begins to flake off your fingers are now red and sticky great there's a large wardrobe here big enough to fit a human being it's certainly empty why do i feel like i'm gonna have to hide in there the table is covered in basic metal tools that seem to have been used on human Maze. There's a rusty saw, a, ha a hammer, and several more custom items. Why is custom in quotes? Student ID name tags mixed in with these various and sundry. Okay. What the hell? Is there a. Oh. It's a torture thing. Uh oh. <laughs> Someone's coming. What do we do? The footsteps are getting closer. Under the table, quickly. What the? <laughs> Won't we be found right away? There's no place else we can all hide. Come on. That ain't no table. That ain't no table. Oh, Dutchie. Hi. 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 Tell me, 
Hang in there. Me no likey. Hi, Naomi. This guy was dead. Um, uh oh, me don't like you. Know me, is she dead? He's gone. Naomi, are you all right? Okay, she's still alive. That's good. Naomi, where the hell is that bastard taking Psycho? Wait, Naomi. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's been through enough as it is. I can't just let this go on. She was the first to deal. Yeah, okay, fair enough. Wait, so she's still alive? Wait, please. Don't run off by yourself, Naomi. Oh, boy. Damn it! Okay, so... Yuka, come on. Stay right by my side. Okay. Next. It's a safe bet she's following this trail of blood. Try to catch up with her. Okay. So follow the blood. I was going to look at it, but oh, it stops here. Huh? The trail of blood from Shinohara's body. It, it stops here. But why? So left or right? Uh, at the T intersection, go left. Okay. Oh boy, and now, wait, what the, where, I don't know, oh my god, why are there so many bodies, I'm not even going to say that in her voice, I'm wondering the same thing, wait, Kishinuma, Kishinuma, are you here? Please, no. Oh, boy. Oh, I don't like this. <laughs> Why? Why do I have to be all alone in here? Leave. No. No, he couldn't be. Is he in here with me after all? No. Nope. He's right there. Don't even think about killing me off just yet. <clears throat> well, hello. I stand corrected. Before I realized it, I got stuck down in a different chute. Almost wound up in the pool. That would have been a real pain in the ass. You okay, Shinazaki? Uh-huh. Okay, then. Yoshiki! And Shinazaki! <gasps> Yoshida! And, and Yuka, too. Good to see you guys. Uh-huh. You two okay? You're out of breath. Naomi. Naomi went after this monster that took Shinohara's body. And, and she got separated from us. Takashima is missing? 
Zooey too. God. It's it's all my fault. See who can get it. Be strong. Remember? Those were Miss Yui's last words. So we have to do what she says. To get out of here alive, okay? Right? Miss Yui, you know, I can't even think of her with anything but a smile on her face. No matter what we were going through, Miss Yui's always been there for us. She's been rooting for us since the very start. I'm sure she still is. Come on, we have to do this. Miss Yui, if for anyone who's passed away at this point, let's not worry her anymore. Okay. Final countdown right now. Right here, right now. Uh-oh. Naomi, please be okay. Alright, here we go. Left to do. Let's finish this up. Psycho. It's Psycho, where are you? What was that? Oh. No, I, I won't let them hurt you anymore. Wow. Naomi is a brave bitch. <laughs> so am I. Yeah? Wait, what? Ayumi. Ah, oh, Yuki, you're here. Does this mean you still have control over your will? Ayumi, don't give in. Huh? You've been stricken with the darkening. Its effects are beginning to take hold of you. There's still time to stop it, but you must hurry. Ah, oh, crap. She's here, just beyond the next room. Whether or not you'll be able to return to your own world depends entirely on her. Go, quickly. Wait, what about Naomi? We can't leave without her. She's... Fighting her own demons right now. Oh no. Oh no. She overcame them. If she's able to resist her own darkening, she'll be alone. I can't imagine that being tough to do. It should be possible to appease even Sachiko. Make certain you're ready. Meeting the final bosses in the next room. Or whatever is considered the final task. Ready to fight. Final boss. I still don't know what the hell is going on in this godforsaken place. But, I've come way too far to back down now. I'm in this till the bitter end. We understand. Come on, everyone. Let's do this. All right. Just remember, the path back home lies with Sachiko. You must find a way to get through to her. Touch her heart. The only reason her heart was altered in the first place is because the principal killed her mother. Which is interesting. She's turned into this thing because... The her principal killed her mother. I, it wasn't intentional, I guess, but... What the hell? There's a rotting corpse hanging from the ceiling. It's Yoshikazu Yanagihori. Of course. Of course he would do that to himself. Okay. Right.
I didn't want to do that, did I? Big brother. My head hurts. Yuka! It's pitch black. Is Sachiko in here? Possibly. What's that? <sighs> Is that Sachiko? Oh my god. That? I told you to stay away. Don't come any closer. Don't look at me. Sachiko? Sachiko, please, listen. We... Leave! Oh, no. Please, leave me. We mean you no harm. Leave now or I'll kill you! Oh, jeez. <sighs> We're not getting through to her. Yeah, I figured it wouldn't be easy. My name is Sogo Takuchi. I work as Kao Kibiki's cameraman and general assistant. The little girl's room? Who's in there? I need to stay out of sight. I hope I'm able to get this. Whatever it is. Please, don't do this. What? Help me! Oh my god. She, I, what? Uh, my body. I've been paralyzed. Uh oh. I can't move. Oh God, is everybody all right? My ears, my ears. Big brother, save me. God, I can't even turn my body to look at her. Are we all frozen like this? What are you doing to me? Uh oh. Yuka, what's happening? Um, she's being killed. Sachiko, you bitch! Leave her alone. Shida, get on with it. Quickly. Get on with what? Appeasing her? Just hurry. Okay. Um. Help me. Please. Don't do this. Two girls. 
one's on a bucket with her hands tied behind her back and a rope around her neck. No, no, please, Naomi, wake up! No! It was while she was blacked. Okay, that's just not fair. I mean, not intentionally. She was being controlled, but still. She just took it away. My God, this is a murder. Okay, that's not fair. That's not fair. Oh, well, that explains why he was randomly afraid. Um, oh yeah, that's, that's not, that's not the Naomi we all know. That's the one who was knocked out and controlled. Okay. Who are you? Okay. Sachiko, this is yours. Your body that was taken from you. Open your eyes. Please. Offer Sachiko's time. Well, as shitty as she's being, yes. I'll give it to her. Offer Naho's notebook? Why would I do that? No. Mom's been suffering just as much as you have. Things you're doing aren't making her happy at all. Offer black cat plushie? Well, she's a child, so yeah, sure. Offer mini D. No! The last thing a child who doesn't understand wants to hear is always you're in wrong. Especially under a circumstance like this. In her brain, her mother just died. No! Even though technically it was like 50 years prior to this, in her mind, which probably is the case. Who? Where's my mommy? Where, where am I? You move again. Does that mean it's working? Satoshi or Naomi come on everyone take out your paper doll scraps okay got it all right okay Sachiko hear her please you want to go home that's what charms really are they represent our regards for other people. They're like micros, oh, microcosms of the soul, right? You and your mom both suffered such horrible fates. All we want to do is free you from that suffering. Chant. Duh. Wait, one, two, three, four, six times, including Sachiko. So. Naomi, the two boys, and the two other girls, and Sachiko. Six times. One. Sachiko, we beg of you. 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 That's four. This is five. Sachiko! We beg of you. One more. Sachiko, we beg of you. That 
was six, right? I can count, right? <laughs> You hush, Bleak Fox. Are we out? Did we do it? Is everyone all right? It's okay. It's nothing serious. Use my ribbon to help stop the bleeding. Hopefully, that should be enough. Yumi. Thank you. Yuka. We did it. Satoshi. Naomi, I'm so glad you're okay. What happened with Shinohara? I'll tell you later. Oh. Uh. Okay. Hi, Yuki. Actually, that wasn't... Yeah, I would say that's more of a final challenge. Now, it's your only chance to escape. The veil between your world and this school is at its thinnest. The gate is open. You need to hurry and get outside the building before it closes. Complete the ritual. Once it closes, this nexus will return to the way it was, and you'll have lost your chance to get out. What? What's going to happen to all of you then? It appears we've become a part of these spaces. Aside from Sachiko, none of us can be saved. For now, I'm free. But it's not going to last long. Soon, I'll continue shaping this place. Just as I always have. No! The school has already begun creating a new Sachiko. What? Oh no. So the real Sachiko probably died in the demon that, uh, like, the, the what's left is probably the rage that was in her. Building up inside the school, and the school's, like, adapting new versions based off that original rage. Please, go. Get out of the building while you still can. Whoa, okay. Okay, so I need to see. One. So counting by the time to go, I can tell. Seven rounds to get out. Okay. Exit the room and follow the path. Down. Okay. Okay, let's see. Down, down, excuse me, follow the blood. Just follow through the navigation of the blocks. That's the same as usual. All the way right down. Left at the intersection up, then follow the path. Eek. Come on. Let's get out of here. Okay. Down. I got 17 seconds to get out of here. That's nothing. in the distance a bell tolls. Sounds like the hour tone of a grandfather clock. Don't stop, you moron. Okay. Wait, what is that? There's a student ID. You idiot. Don't pause. The bell tolls again. Okay, so... How many... 
many times does the bell toll before you run out of time? I don't know. Two, one. Third toll. Oh, this place is a plot. Oh, this way. Yes, this way. By the time you hit seven tolls, it's don't oh, come on. It's game over. If I were to guess, because I saw the number seven on the frickin' go, 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 go. Oh, come on. Fifth toll. Where do I go? Uh, this is horrifying. The sad part is you absolutely need to know where to go or you're screwed. Who would know where to go in this? There's too much. The air is beginning to feel thicker. Okay, where the hell do I go? Go all the way to the right and then all the way down to exit. Oh my gosh. 14. Are you kidding me? I failed. Wait, did I? Oh my gosh. At the very last millisecond. We made it. All we have to do now is climb over this fence. We're home free. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Please work, please work, please work. And? Did it work? I can't believe I made that. That was... Oh. Huh? Second. Big brother! Yuka! Yuka! Uh, the, you really made it. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh boy. Well, we made it. At least the five of us that were able to. So, the five of us who survived the ordeal able to return to Kisaragi Academy to the real world in our own time. For a while, we were all just so happy to be home and to be alive. We were overjoyed. But it didn't take long before the grim reality of what happened wiped the smiles off our faces. Kasui, Shinohara, Morishi, and Suzumoto weren't with us anymore. Well, be careful on your way home, okay? I will. Bye. Later. Wait. Where do you want to go? Hmm? Don't stay home tomorrow. Come to school. Please. 
Okay. Can you get out of that pretty quick? Didn't think I'd be able to sleep that Can night after that all the things I'd seen. Mm -hmm. But I wound up sleeping like a rock. Probably out of exhaustion, dude. Give me a hug. The next morning, with heavy hearts. You and Faith woke up in the middle of the that we all trudged toward you a school devoid of Miss Huey. Do something, go to the others. Now. Yet fate still had one more sick twist in store for us. Oh. What? What is your name? Shinohara? Where is she? Am I supposed to know who you're talking about? What? Wait. So it's like they never existed in the first place? Our homeroom TA's name is Matsuda. Still half asleep or something? Transfer student? Are we getting someone new? Oh boy. It was like the four people who died in that school had never existed. What the hell? Normally I'd say what the hell is going on, but in this case, the same thing happened in Misao. No, this isn't right. How can no one else remember any of them? All those times we spent with Psycho and the others. Am I supposed to just accept that none of that really happened? Yui, Suzumoto, Morishik, and Shinohara. Are you telling me the, they only exist in our memories now? That's just beyond cool. No. What the fudge? It's horrible. Still, absorbing innumerable souls and ingesting the thoughts of innocent boys and girls. Heavenly Host Elementary School stands firm with a newly appointed Sachiko at its core. There are those, pre there are those precious few who survived, those who lost their lives, those who were overcome by the dark curses therein. And among them all, are the spirits of those who were wronged, bearing an unimaginable pain and endlessly searching for respite from their sadness. For a place to call home. Man. That's, that is a cruel way to end a story. succeeded but simultaneously failed okay what's going on here sorry to call you in here like this Satoshi oh it's no problem at all what's up I need a part of something there's something I want you to see Isn't that? It is. It's that unsent text message from Shinohara I showed you. Yeah. I need to tell you something. So, it was you? Yes, but no. Psycho couldn't move, but instead of saving her, a noose around her neck. It wasn't you, though. When I saw that scene play out, my mind just shut down. I, I couldn't think at all. A and a black mist began forming around me. It was slipping away. 
I didn't care either. Nothing mattered to me anymore. I would have welcomed death. Yeah, maybe to yourself, but not to your friend. I wish I could take it back. Yeah. Actually, the darkening is failing to take her over. Because you can't be human without mourning and regret. Darkness had begun seeping into every pore. My body was pitch black. I was right on the verge of losing consciousness. And then... Text. This is that text message. Why am I receiving it now? At the mo moment you need it most. It doesn't matter. I don't even want to live anymore. Read it. Read the text. Damn it, Naomi, read the text. There's just nothing left to live for. Oh my gosh. Read the text, Naomi. Read it. It's the same message. Psycho, are you trying to tell me something? I think Psycho's fully aware it wasn't the real her. She must be spamming me. Probably furious. Read the damn message. There. No. No, she's not mad at me. We had such a huge fight. Without close those two are, I have a hard time believing she hated. You can't possibly forgive me. Especially not after what I did to her. It it wasn't the real you. It's kind of like the video I talked about earlier today. It's the same kind of concept. It wasn't you. It was a part of you that was really, really dark and you had no control over. Which... Again, if you're wondering about that, watch an earlier video. There's no excuse for my actions. You, you must hate me, right? I have to hold some kind of grudge. If Psycho's anything like me, she doesn't. No hard feelings. So sorry. Poor you, Psycho. <laughs> I know this is a super lengthy episode, but with the climax, it's very hard to not finish. Hey, Psycho, she. She really existed, didn't she? She really did spend all that time with us, right? Yes, she did. She was real, Naomi. Miss Yui and the others, too. I can't stand the thought that I'll never see them again. <laughs> One last time. I just want to talk to Psycho. Last time. My statement stands. That's a horrible ending. I mean, that's the that's that 
that's the default ending. That's the true ending of the game, but... Everybody's dead. The end. What the hell? Um, out of direct respect towards copyright, I'm going to mute it, um, but, I've got a, I've got mixed feelings about this. started to fall asleep while I was doing this. My voice is so soothing to her that she falls asleep to it. And then there's this. This is probably one of the least soothing things I've ever experienced. Even for a horror game. This this was basically just death central. This wasn't even horror. Or this wasn't even like your generic horror game that I usually experience. Like, again, Misao and like the two that are always shown at the end of these videos so far um me sal and the witch's house i mean those two at least have jump scares they have enjoyment i mean i enjoyed this don't get me wrong but this was basically just hey murder this is murder central watch all of your friends die and then we'll say the end why I mean, even the ending. The ending of this was, okay, you guys escape, but you're lost. People say some of your friends never existed. People say that you're crazy, and only you get to get the imprint of these characters ever existing in your mind. And you'll never get to talk to them again. What the hell? I mean, outside of that factor, it was a good game. It had the, the, the character, the main antagonist, Sachiko, great motive for her, but outside of that, I mean, I, great mechanics, um, I don't know why they keep, you don't really ever lose it, um, but outside of that, what's, what's the point, but, I mean, sure, it's a long series, so I'm sure there are nitbits that if I were to continue the series, then I'd probably figure it out, but I don't know, if that happens, then the length of this video is going to be the g general length of but we'll see. I doubt it. I'm not even going to do the extras here. I just wanted to do the main story. So with that being said, is this the ending? Is this the end? Are we done? Yes, we're done. Thank you guys so much for watching this long episode of... I did not expect it to be this long, but it was a good finale. Longer. Yeah. <laughs> I did not expect that. You fell okay, asleep, so I was like, eh, might as well. Did you do Actually, I am going to be cleaning a lot of it, so no. No, it's not necessary. It's, uh, like always, my finale episodes are always longer than the main series episodes, for the most part. That being said, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Um, if you like this video, make sure to push that like button, and so far you can't see me anymore. If you really like it, consider subscribing to the channel. Um, we do horror stuff a lot. Not frequently, just the ones that are usually really old. I mean, I'm probably going to have to do Slender at some point, also but not yet. next time, you guys <laughs> see us? No, that's not true. I know what she's about to say. It's not 100% true yet. Um, but yeah, we're going... No. <sighs> Stop it, stupid freaking thing. I just don't know why they got you to do the one thing I wanted. Anyway... She's scamming over the time. Um, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, Want to check out any other horror games that we've done on this channel? Click the link in the bottom right corner. Our train will take you to that destination. Or if you missed any of the stops on this ride, click the link across my head here. Our train will take you there. Um, in the meantime, this train's off to its next destination, but we hope to catch you guys in another ride. Bye.